Hey guys, how's it going? Kevin the Rocket here, and right now I'm going to be doing a review on how to get uh, a free screen recorder called Cam Studio. Uh, it's alright, it's not the best, but uh, hey, what do you get for free anyways? Um, I'm currently using Camtasia Studio, and so yeah, and uh, it is a paid product, so I'm sure they have cracks out there somewhere. Just search for it. So, uh, they also have Hypercam, but I'm not sure how good it is because I really don't use it. Um, but I will show you where to get this Cam Studio at. So what you want to do is go to your internet browser and go to uh, camstudio.org. Scroll down. They also have a beta right here. I haven't used it yet. I don't know how it is, so just get the Cam Studio 2.0. Save it to the desktop or wherever. And you also want to get the lossless Kodak if you want. I always get it if I use it, but I don't really use this because I use Camtasia Studio. Okay, so this is what we have right here. The installer is right here, and the uh, and here's the lossless Kodak. Now, uh, whenever you want to go and see what the settings are for it like this for HD and stuff like that, you want to go to YouTube and type in best HD settings can take this studio or something like that uh, that'd be the best thing I agree next start then it will install you click OK OK and as you can see you get Camtasia Studio, Movie Player, Movie Player 2.1 and um, SV or I mean SWF producer and uh, this actually doesn't have a editor you have to use like uh, such as uh, Windows Movie Maker or something like that. So what you want to do is open up this program. Oh wait, I forgot to install these lists. Lost this could actually just have a run. Yes. Next. Next. Install. Finish. Okay, so it's installed. Now, uh, so we will open up this program, and this is what we have. Uh, the other file button, record, stop, pause, exit, region, you can do a fixed region, which is like just a certain amount, just so you want to do, or you can select it if you want it, or you can do, just say, uh, 1280 by 720, and it will have your whole screen, or you can just do full screen. Um, let's see, video options. Here, you want to go in here and click Lossless Kodak, and then you can change all these settings if you want. If you want to change Z, you have to click Auto Adjust, and it will, you can make the quality whatever you want, but I don't really mess with this recorder that much, so I don't really do that. Now, uh, cursor options. Let's see, you can hide your cursor, show cursor, um, highlight cursor with a little bubble around it and stuff like that, but now this is the part that's kind of screwed up with it. Um, they have do not record audio, record audio from microphone. Just say so you want to record from the microphone and your speakers. I'm not really sure how to do that, but just say right here you want to record from the speakers. You click on speakers and you get this air right here. So now whenever you record, nothing's going to happen. It's kind of stupid how they have it set up. You can go to audio options and set this stuff up. Auto pan, that would be... Uh, and then auto pan speed if you want to have it high, low, whatever. That would be uh, if you want to, whenever you're recording, you want this to uh, follow your cursor. Um, auto pan program options. Hide flashing rectangle during. I would do that because it messes up to that recording if you don't. And uh, minimize program at the startup of the recording. Okay, so yeah, that's basically it. Here's your keyboard shortcuts. F8 is to record. F9 stop. Um, F8 is also to pause. Cancel keys F10, F11, F12. I don't know what that crap is for, but. And oh, you got some screen screen annotations, video annotations, normal view, compact view, buttons view, and help and about. Let's see about. Um, Cam Studio version. So yeah, it's just free products and stuff like that. So I will record something. Wait, let 
me see. And I'll just say this is a desktop, for example. And as you can see, the quality isn't that bad, but as you can see, there's like little ripples and stuff in here that's not very quality, but you can change the settings for all that stuff. So, uh, yeah, and I also have a new channel, or it was my backup channel, but I made a new backup channel. It is Kevin the Rocket One, and I made it for uh, purposes to make free software, uh, make videos how to get free software and stuff like that. So, if you just want to check out my other channel, Kevin the Rocket One, uh, go right for it, and uh, so subscribe to that one also, and also please subscribe to me. Uh, I guess that's it, so please comment and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.